Corvel Pro is an admin UI for .NET Core applications and you get additional things like uh, job scheduling and you get health metrics and lots of other things like that. Today we're going to look at installing Corvel Pro. Today I'll be following the instructions that are in the documentation. You can visit that at docs.pro.corvel.net. The first thing we need to do is create a new .NET Core application that includes the EF Core authentication. Next, we're going to install Corvel Pro through NuGet. Next, in our startup file, in the configure services method, we need to add a call to add Corvel Pro. Next, we want to add a call to add newtonsoft.json, and that's just going to configure some JSON stuff that Corvel needs. And then we're going to add a call to use Corvel Pro, and that's going to configure um, a lot of stuff under the covers for you automatically. Next, we'll go into our EF Core context and we'll add a few things that Corvel Pro needs to work. For our DB context, we'll implement this iCorvel Pro DB context interface and then we'll stub out all the properties that it needs. Next, we'll create a migration for the changes we've just applied to our DB context. And then we'll apply the changes we've made to the schema to our database. Next, we'll run our application and we'll take a look at the dashboard that Corvel Pro provides out of the box. Generally speaking, if you follow these instructions with a new .NET Core application, you can be up and running with Corvel Pro in less than a few minutes.